Well hello there guys, Medieval Squirrel here with part 45 of our Ikiklaw campaign for Mortal Empires and we're going to pick things up where we left them last time. We have taken Bordelow and we have tricked this army into coming south towards Brion. The Fae Enchantress is about to fall into a trap. If she disembarks from her boat uh, then she is going to end up in a world of trouble. Uh, in the north, Bastogne is reasonably open for Ikit's army to go off and take in the next turn. And we can jump on over to Grungzint and take that away as well. To be honest though, probably not going to keep hold of it. I'm probably just going to sack it and raise it and then jump back over so I can defend at Longueil. Uh, from this army, Mogan the Devoted, who is almost definitely going to be going in there at some point. Uh, for now though, let's just spend a little bit of our hard-earned cash. Uh, better walls there. Uh, there. Anywhere the public order is not doing well. Uh, Avalon. Oh, Avalon. Corruption. Oh, because corruption's too high, you don't like it. Right, that's an extra plus two. I mean, it is a little bit of a shame, but you just, you can't ask for things like that. Mm. I'm thinking if we get rid of this. Mm, but I need it for that. Ah! No, we'll get rid of it. We'll just leave that for now uh they need walls oh what can they get no they need walls anywhere else trace trace isn't happy but six turns away from leveling up fine anywhere else phoenix gate oh no that jumped way too far uh corone corone is never going to be happy not until we take corone uh, right. I mean, Doom Wheels would be quite nice. Haven't really played with them yet. Would like to. Right. On a serious note, how much would another army cost? Ooh. Ooh, probably not then. Not for a minute. Unicorn Gate. Let's level you up. And then we'll keep the rest of the money. And skip, skip, skip. And the turn. So yes, plan for this part then. Is hopefully not to have the uh, Cult of Sotek attackers. Because that would be not very nice. I want to hopefully destroy the Fey Enchantress. Get an army down south again to carry on the war in Araby. Preferably Lord Skrulk. And then use the three armies that I've got in Britonia to wreck what's left of their economy. Oh, you fools! Lovely. Right, so the Fey Enchantress has done exactly what she shouldn't have done, which is exactly what we wanted her to do. Uh, oh, bugger it. No, they've successfully blocked us. No! Oh, you bastards! Oh, I was so happy and everything. Oh, right. Well, in that case then, you... Are you able to assassinate her? No, uh, probably not. You, though. Uh, probably not again. Should still have another turn or so. So what we're going to do is we're going to attempt to assassinate her. Probably going to go badly for us. Success! Oh, yes. Right, and then you. Are you able to hit the army? In the replenishment. Failure, oh, yeah. okay. Guess you win some, you lose some. Right, we're going to head towards Bastogne. 
Right, continue the siege for a minute because I want to get the next bit set up. Which is to jump on over to Grungzint, where you do not have anywhere near enough troops to stop me from absolutely rampaging through your lands. And you have no walls either. Uh, ooh. Winter Tooth. I mean, it's not great, but we can deal with it. Uh, then we're going to save in case of a crash, and we're going to run into this battle. Yeah, we'll keep it at 25 wins of magic. That's perfectly okay. Uh, artillery can be like so. Have Ikit there and Ruby there, just so they can take all of the damage if possible. Bring those guys over like so. Bring those guys a bit further over that way. Just because I'm not sure if that other tower is going to be able to hit us. And I don't really want it to be able to. And just group everyone up. Because it's easier for me. And you over here. And warp grinders you can come back here as well. Where's the cav? Are they already back here? They are. Good. Right. Come off of that. And hit that tower to begin with. Right. Ooh. That's nasty. That is very nasty. We are not fans of that. That's quite a lot of damage, actually. Quite a bit more than is than we're used to. Oh, and they're lobbing shells at us from that artillery piece. Right. Hit the peasant bowman. Their artillery launches to there. So let's put all of these guys to here where they can't be hit by the artillery. But where hopefully they can shoot at people. And then just to play havoc with them. Do that. Into the field trebuchet. Kill the crews. Or at the very least get them off of their bloody catapults. As long as you're not on your guns, you're okay. Right, let's bring you up. Okay, they're doing all right over there. The catapults are now... I think they're off of their trebuchets now. Chase them! Run, my little ratty boys. Stab them in the back. I, I think we managed to get one there. Okay. Yes. Right. Catapults, no more. Good. Right. Gisales. No, sorry. Rattling gunners. Running gunners move to there, and we'll get the warp grinders up over here as well. Has the gate been destroyed? No, it has not. You guys get down here. You can ballistic strike and come on down. And then let's get in with these units on the flank as well. And let's bring in the yeah, let's bring in the doom flayers. But the artillery is uh, that well, they're moving up. They are trying, bless them. All of you, just bring yourselves along there. 
Engineer. Right. Let's do a strike on there. Arcane conduit and a strike there. Well, the rattling gunners are most certainly having a bit of fun now. Where are those warp grinders? That's fine. Let's uh, throw one of those up there, see what we can do. Right. And now... See if we can get in through this section of wall for me, please. Uh, augment of the winds. Lovely. And then we'll go for another one of those up there. Another one of those right next to it. And... A vortex as well, please. And I think that wall is now mostly blood, guts and bones. Lovely. Hi. Even if the wall is stopping most of it, it's not stopping enough of it to actually... <laughs> actually stop them all from being I mean there's nothing left now it hey, can I oh, no to there scorch along here please and then throw some rats there bring these guys up on this flank with the warp grinders Pick it, throw that at him. You guys come in as well. Hopefully that Doom Rocket will go through. Pop that on there. Steady, man. Steady. And pestilent breath straight through the center there. There we go. Our warriors are great. Well, they're rats. Do you really expect that much else? Where's our Doom Flayers? You can come in as well. Let's pop that up against that wall. Where are you? You're on your way in. You're going to have to fight your way through, lads. And we're going to throw one of those up there. Zap. Hi. <laughs> right, and now all of these guys charge. Straight through the middle of it. And then a Vermintide, roughly about there. Smells of plague. Smells of plague. Mm. Now that, that is something that could sell. Smells of plague. End the battle. Lovely stuff, decisive victory. Okay, we lost eight. They lost 1,069. Something tells me that wasn't quite balanced. Yeah, that also resolved slightly off. Lovely. Uh, we're going to sack it again because we want the money. And then we're just going to do level two. Spend a little bit of food, but not, not too much. Uh, and then we're going to go for growth and public order. Uh, and as to the reason I'm doing two, I want to try and conserve some of the food. I mean, I know we're greedy people. I know we're eating all the food, but I want to conserve at least some of it. Uh, right, Ruby, uh, 
Trixie for some magic resistance. Uh, turn the screen back around. We have lots of money again. Artois is doing fine. They're doing okay. They're okay. Over here is okay. So that's really bumped up our, um, our money. Where's our little spy? Come on, spy. Need you down here. Right, so we'll... Yeah, we'll do that, and then we'll knock that up as well. That's pretty much all of our food, unfortunately. Ooh. Ouch. Yep, they're coming for me. Orderlo needs... Growth and public order. No, we'll go walls first instead. Garrison, rather. And end the turn. Oh, they can reach us. Oh, bugger it. And I now don't... Oh, I don't even have my priests. Uh, right, time to try out a slightly new tactic then. Okie dokie. Now, I think we may as well use the enemy's, uh, the enemy's thing up here. You know, they think that uh, this will bring them joy and happiness, so it may well do for us. Uh, and what we're going to do is we're going to plonk ourselves slightly forward. No. Giselles can sit up here. All in one long line. Like so. And guard mode. Rattling gunners. One block there. One block here. And one block down here. Oh, wrong side. Okay, like so. And they are all going to be on guard mode. And then Storm Vermin. Alright, let's grab all of them for a second here. Let's grab at least one to be up on here. Two to be in here. Two to be in here. One to be here. And one back and over here all of you will be on guard mode warp grinders on this side also on guard mode and queek somewhere in the middle there should be enough yep yeah, there's enough height for those Giselles to hit over the top let's see if this works pull them forward just a smidge same with the artillery, or just a smidge. Right, and we should have more than enough range to devastate anything that comes in close. Now, main targets are obviously cavalry, but mostly what we want to get rid of See if we can get them drawn in. Scout! 
Yep. Now, this is possibly a waste, but... Well, how much damage did that do? Fair amount. Not the best one, but uh, certainly okay. Rotate that round a smidge. Right. Right, pull out in front. Like so, come on. All round to the flank. Hammer them. That group of questing knights is doing my head in. Right, rotate yourselves round. And bring those guys up on the flank. You guys to there, you guys back in there. Bring those to there, pull those up there. That unit back, that unit forward. That unit back forward again. Right, rattling guns, round onto this flank. Bring those out. Queek. To here. Fire on there. Pull those to the flanks. And in we go. Pull back up here. Turn round and onto those guys. Charge in. Charge in. Queek. Jump into this section. Right, charge up. Explosion does not affect friendly troops. Right, let's get you into the centre. We need to take out that Fey Enchantress. Go on to there. You two units, fire round. Pull around, fire onto there. Right, you guys up and into the back of those Grail Guardians. That entire right flank was devastated. Right, all of you, focus on the Fey Enchantress, kill her. Good. Right. Grail Guardians next. Right, not quite. Close victory. We have, however, relieved our town. That was actually not too bad as a tactic. The execution was a bit poor. Too many units of cavalry, I'm afraid. And we did have to use up our Doom Rocket. Took out most of the infantry for us, which was nice. Which was very nice. I think next time, have a couple more units of Storm Vermin in reserve. As opposed to being on the front line. Okay, so I'll take the replenishment. Oh, I should have gone for food, shouldn't I? Oof. Silly me. Jesus, how many armies? Okay, let's come out of that. Let's have our people back, shall we? Oh, well, we'll take one of them anyway. Go in there. And auto-resolve. 
Lovely. Uh, and then we're going to take the food. Uh, Doom Tide. The Chaos Horde has pulled in a remorseless tide scouring all in its path, yet even the most savage flood must eventually receive, leaving the battered survivors to pick up through the flotsam on ravaged shores. Yada yada. Um, no, Chaos doesn't really bother me. I just shoot them. So, Queek. No, we kind of need to go through weapons, team ammunition and damage. Because they are, quite frankly, devastating. Uh, Vermintide. Ooh, Plague Furnace. Yes. Blech. And then we're going to Force March down past Brion. Okay, that did not go quite as planned. We're going to scout. And then you need to go in there as well. We've got Bastone. And fortunately though, we do need to come back south. So let's start moving south slowly. I will not blight my soul. Aquitaine, have you got walls? No, but you've got a half decent garrison. Good. Fortify it up. And then Caravan. You've got a big old garrison there. Let's head down this way then. Mighty am I I Let's go in to the siege of Grongzint. You'll lead from rear, yes, we know. Uh, and then we need to build another Doom Rocket. Oh, we only got one. Oh, well. Uh, Gisero, Walls, Bastone. Garrison here is pretty choddy, but he is... Ah, oh, he's level 7. That's not great. They're going in there. This army here, then. You're a smidge damaged. How far can they go? Quite far. Let's pull up this way. Now we're replenishing. We should be able to head into Bilbali next turn. Not going to do anything there just in case. Magritta, big old garrison. I am a lord of Jesus, Royal Never. Hippogriff Knights. They are really churning out some units considered. now. I will not blight my soul. Okay. Nasty little blighters. Might soon be time to just spawn an army and head south. But... Hmm. Right, actually no, we're gonna we're gonna sort this out next time with Lowen's retaliation. Uh so if you've enjoyed, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Check out the videos that should be appearing on your screen around about now. And don't forget to tune in next time for some more Ikit action. But then though, bye for now.